In this video, Gideon reacts to Logan Paul firing George Janko from Impulsive. So Logan Paul did fire George from Impulsive. And here's what Gideon had to say about it. So George has been missing from all of the recent Impulsive podcasts. And that is no coincidence, Logan Paul has fired George from Impulsive. So Logan Paul did actually disrespect George Janko. I love this outlet and it exists because people watch. And without people watching, I'm, I just have a show like Um you just saw the clip and he definitely had enough time to say it's george and george himself does believe logan paul called him out and george did actually end up responding so he said to the impulsive fans i'm so sorry i can't speak about things not my choice i do love damn they little baby this nigga remember little baby in the bigger picture he was like there's things there's some things i can't talk about i get it i get it they, they little baby them he can't say shit you guys and for those of you sending me the clip of them talking shit it's all love i've already moved on from that toxic environment <sighs> that's crazy facetime mike i got another t bro i gotta know all right mike's not gonna answer i mean i mean it is what it is what's in the dark comes to the light you can't say it's george you can't say it's george for sure that's how we get misunderstandings and problems. Also, while George is a good guy, Impulsive was never the place for him. He just wasn't meant for that scene. Lost one of his realest friends from the come up and his first ever vlog. Sad how people can change. I wish George nothing but the best, man. But it's clear to see Gideon is supporting George. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about this whole situation in the comments. Make sure you subscribe to keep up with all your daily dosage.